This videography investigates the practices employed by young adult roll your own smokers in Dunedin, a provincial city in New Zealand. Roll your own tobacco has traditionally been associated with stereotypes of older, heavily addicted and disadvantaged smokers or socially ostracised individuals such as tramps and prisoners. Roll your own tobacco has also been perceived as lower quality and thus less appealing. Yet, despite these negative perceptions, roll your own tobacco use has recently increased in many countries, including New Zealand, South Africa, Thailand, the UK, Australia, Canada and Europe, typically in response to its lower cost relative to tailor-made cigarettes. Within New Zealand, roll your own tobacco use peaks amongst young adults aged 20 to 24. We identified three important themes within our data. Firstly, our informants subscribed to beliefs that enabled them to establish roll your own tobacco as superior. They considered it to be more natural and thus less harmful, despite evidence to the contrary. They also declared it better tasting than tailor-made cigarettes. Secondly, participants created and enacted usage rituals where they used specific artefacts and micro-behaviours to construct cigarettes they saw as personal and artisanal. Rolling rituals also enabled participants to control their tobacco usage whilst facilitating interaction with others. Finally, an elicitation task featured unattractively coloured papers revealed that these disrupted the value participants' rituals created for them. In conclusion, young adults imbue roll-your-own tobacco with positive attributes, many of which centre on rolling rituals or draw on widely held misconceptions of roll-your-own tobacco as less harmful. Policy makers could address the rising use of roll your own tobacco by increasing the excise tax applied to counter perceptions of roll your own as more cost effective. Further, our findings suggest that mandating dissuasively coloured papers could disrupt reduced harm connotations and undermine perceptions of roll your own as superior to tailor made cigarettes. However, policymakers should monitor attributes associated with roll your own tobacco as evidence that erroneous reduce harm beliefs are widespread and may justify restricting the product itself.